Welcome to Orlando, Florida. Today is the day of the Falcon Heavy launch. Tesla behind me, this is not mine, I just saw it in the parking lot. I came here a couple of years ago with Zach from Jerry Rig Everything and Davey from April and Davey. We tried to see the first SpaceX launch from 39A, Launchpad 39A, and it was a complete failure. The only way to describe the social media corral is complete sadness. NASA was not fun to work with. I'm gonna make sure that he doesn't come back and I didn't know there was a signed seating. I mean, there was no. It wasn't a good experience. Today, I've been lucky enough to be invited to the secret level three of Tesla's referral program because you guys are so awesome to buy so many Teslas off of our code. I'm going to show you guys what it's like to go to a Tesla launch reward event to see the Falcon Heavy launch of SpaceX. Should be pretty cool. I'm excited. There's a lot of people here, people from all over the world that are the top referrers of Teslas. We are going to a building that is off-site. It's not right at the NASA facility. It's in Cape Canaveral, though. We're going to be up off the ground on the seventh level, so we should be able to get a shot for you guys on camera that shows the rocket's landing. So, oh man, I hope I can get that shot. I hope I can see it. If it has to wait till tomorrow, it's going to be a little bit of a downer, but I, I can't wait. The party is getting real right now. Check this out. We've got Kim here. We've got Lan Liam and Landon are here. The king of all things Tesla. And one. <laughs> it's time. We are heading out to the shuttle buses. It's go time. Oh, snacks. SpaceX has snacks. I'll take one of those. Oh boy. Look at all these. We're gonna need. Cheetos, okay. Yes, snacks on the bus. It's already better than NASA right now. I haven't done this yet, but this is my brother Brian. He's from Arizona. If you've watched our video where we cut open oysters. My brother, this is my brother Brian. I'm excited. I have shucked exactly one oyster in my entire life. Let's not get too close to the bathroom. It's stinky. Okay, look at Kim loading up on the snacks. It's not for the kids, don't give me Tower in Cape Canaveral. This is it. Thank you for the ride. And uh, this is cool. There's a big old tower right here, and apparently this is going to be the place. It's going to be launching if it launches today at 8 p.m. So we have about three and a half hours until go time. But that was a fun ride. They played like Starman music and all kinds of stuff. We were cheering and having fun. So this is it. This building, this funky little building right there is where we will watch it. They have a lot of security, a lot of police officers, and they even have three Teslas all lined up. We have about three hours until the window. It's from eight o'clock until like 8.36, I think is the window. So we just kind of wait here. We got some inside info, Ooh. so yeah. Wait, wait, wait. okay, inside, what, is this? what is this? Inside information, this is just between us. Okay. The rocket's actually about 10 miles away. We're gonna see it. That's kind of far. Far, but it's gonna be an awesome epic shot. But the money shot, the two boosters that are landing are gonna be right behind those planes behind us. And we're gonna be on the balcony, less than half a mile away from the boosters. We're as close as you can get, so I like this. One of my questions about this event is, who's here? Like, what type of people get invited to this thing? It's really cool to talk to people and find out their stories about, like, how they got so many referrals. There's a lot of people here that have this in their Tesla account. Check this out. Not one, but two free roasters in his account. How many referrals did you have? This is my buddy John. About 115. 115? You're not a YouTuber. No. He's a doctor. He travels all around the U.S. and works in trauma. How did you get 115 referrals? Whenever we go to new states every three to six months, uh, just give a car that we bought a few hundred ERP 90D out to the doc or whoever we're looking to help get into an S or X for the day, for the week, let them drive it, and then, you know, once they get the experience, they love it, get the referral code, and then assist through the process. You know, if any questions come up, we're supercharging any of that, we go through. I've been an owner since the first rows are in 06, so. What is a doctor's perspective when you work in trauma and you see people come in from all the car crashes? Does that influence your decision to have a Tesla? 
Definitely. So probably like 80 to 90 percent of the incidents are fibia, tibia, like femur fracture, it causes the pelvis, you know, the, the femoral artery, you know, severe damage. And it tests that you have the compaction zone, the, the front, okay. which, which allows that uh, vehicle basically like 70 mile an hour just smack the wall and you, and you can walk away rather than the motor compacting in through a very thin aluminum wall. Okay, so if you're on the fence about getting a Tesla and you're like, I don't know if it's worth the extra money, if you have the money for it, I think that's a pretty good argument and a good case for why you should get a Tesla because he's a trauma doctor that travels around every single state in the US, sees accidents all the time. If it's good enough for the trauma doctor and it makes sense for him, I think it would be good enough for everybody. So anyway, thanks Elon for making safe cars. It's uh, officially been scrubbed. That stinks. I've been to two SpaceX rocket launches and they've both been scrubbed. So hopefully tomorrow's the day because I need to get home. Tomorrow's the last day I can stay here. But we're gonna check out the seventh floor regardless. Here it is. This is where we would have been watching it today, which wow. Okay, live stream would be right there. Oh, that's pretty. Oh, the sun's about to set, look at that. So the rocket would take off. There's the giant space center right there. That is the tallest one-story building in the world. I'm zooming in, there it is. There's Falcon Heavy. And then the landing place is right over here. Two rocket boosters are going to land, which is pretty darn cool that we'll be able to see them. Hopefully tomorrow it happens because this is a killer view. The word is out. Look at all the people that are now leaving, riding into the sunset. that we missed it, but hey, this is what happens in rocket launches. They gotta be safe. There's a big old satellite on there. There's a lot of money on the line. There's a lot of safety on the line. This is what it's like. This is my second rocket launch. Welcome to day two of the rocket adventure, the Falcon Heavy. And I haven't even really explained it yet, but this is my brother, Brian. He's been in some videos before with us, but he lives in Arizona. Really, really smart when it comes to science. He can appreciate what is about to happen tonight. We have about an hour and a half until the beginning of the window starts. Hey guys. Oh, we're going to. We're gonna go see if we can take the helicopter first. Look what I found across the street. Here's our pilot. So apparently this is your first day on the job. 1.5. <laughs> 1.5 5 day on the job. Um, yeah, we're, gonna, we're still doing this. Real, real talk for a second here. It really is his first day on the job. And this thing was only 20 bucks a person. I was prepared to pay. I just told Brian right when we walked in, if it's anything less than $500, I'm in. Turns out for $20, you can get a four to six minute ride along the Cape Canaveral or along the port. Perfect. We are currently taking the doors off. We're Florida. It's much better to be We're flying We're with home. the doors off. Helicopters in Port Canaveral, Florida. He made a mistake. He left me with his camera running. I wonder if we're live streaming. Here's our sign: 8884. Uh, open seven days a week, 365 days a
that when we got over the water and he just turned it was like we we're gonna get dumped right out over the ocean that was great we are five and a half minutes away from the rocket actually taking off. Finally, check out how many people are here. We're all here on the seventh floor of this exploration building that you saw earlier that we flew around. I wanna just enjoy this. So you're gonna see my reaction here. I do have a camera set up right there that will get hopefully the boosters as the two boosters land. That's really the exciting part. You're gonna get our reaction. That's what it's gonna be. And I can't believe it's finally happening. This is my third time coming to Florida to this area to watch a rocket and I've failed every time. So I feel lucky. Today is the day. Ground up, cold up, it's starting. Yes! Here we go. Go for launch. Here we go! Come on, Rocket. Come on, Rocket. Watch the launch pad! Oh! I don't even know what else to say. It's so bright. It's, it's seven minutes from the time that the rocket takes off to when the boosters come down and land. Um, but it, with how fast the rocket seemed to get up there, it seems kind of surprising this thing's falling from space and it does take this long to get down. That just tells you how high it went. It's just... There they are. Whoa! Oh! Oh, got him, got him. See them, guys? Right there. See them right there? Yeah, I see them. See them falling out of the sky? No. Are falling. Straight, you're too far right, Mitchell. Left, the left, left, right there. Right there. Oh, see them falling? They go. Here they go. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. Yeah! 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 There's that booster landing legs at the floor. Amazing! Yeah. Amazing! Yeah. Wow! Yeah. Five boosters have landed. Recovery yeah. 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 Yes! Yeah. 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 Oh my goodness! Wow! Yeah. Wow! Yeah. I've never seen anything like that in my life. Incredible. Uh, once in a lifetime. The sonic boom scared me. <laughs> Are you happy that you stayed here for an entire week for that? You know Florida's grown on me. <laughs> Jack, did you like that? Uh, so unreal. Yeah. Good. He said, again. 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 Oh, unbelievable. Unbelievable. I'm so glad I'm here. Amazing. You like I've never seen anything like it. Yeah. Well, you sure? Thank you. Yeah. So if the launch would not have been successful today, they wouldn't have handed these out. That was the only situation they could give us these shirts and this patch. Tesla didn't pay for me to come out here. They did give us this experience here because of all the referrals that you guys were able to help us get. Thank you guys for using our code and actually buying Teslas, but then also thanks to Tesla and SpaceX for letting us come out here and see this. It was a once in a lifetime thing. If you ever have a chance to see a rocket launch, his first day on the job. And this thing was- 888-4-RIDE, F-O-R-R-I-D-E. Perfect. 